think it may be this one. Yeah. That's the one. Hand aid. What is this again? Handmade band aid. Heals your wounded body. Gone after a use. Plain old garbage pail. Water flowing. Bakery. Hello, may I help you? What shall I get you? Hmm. I can start uh, buying croissants now, because those are better than burgers. And we'll carry, or of course. Actually, I need to check out how condiments apply to burgers. Just how well does those, uh, do those work? I saw a beat up tour bus go on the far side. We can't go through the tunnel. The band is really noisy. How the boys, the ghosts didn't approach the bus. Must be great to be so happy, look, go lucky, huh? Well, there's a thing on the ground. Who's this lady? That's right. There's a rumor that a monster called Belch is screwing up the town. Blech. That's a gross, twisted name, even for a monster. Mm. So everybody's talking about how Belch makes the zombies. Oh, let's see here. There's a skip sandwich inside. Thanks. That kid? The kid was a monster. Okay. Zombies and ghosts are on the loose here, so I can't get to between... To four, two center four said, maybe the hidden road is in the graveyard is safe. So now I know there's a hidden road in the yard, graveyard. I overheard the zombies whisper. Master Belch will give us our lives back. Master Belch is a zombie leader. He must be really pukey. Uh, hello? I'm so scared of the zombies, I spend all my time running from them. I can't even get home! There's a rumor that there's an underground path at the edge of the graveyard that takes you somewhere. When you get through the path, you'll meet a dirty, stinky, ugly, powerful monster. I wet my pants just thinking about it. This mo town seems very dark, right? People are mostly living at the center of town. I wonder how we should get the town back from the zombies. Don't talk too loud. What do you want? I've got what you need, man. Oh, um... I think these... These are not mine. Keep a watch out for the bad guy. The headquarters of the Zombie Relief Corps is in the, cent the circus tent at the center of town. We want to crush the zombies, except I think they'll crush us. No one's here now. Okay, I've already been here. Oh, I gotta go through a cemetery, I think they said. Spooky ghost. Ah, there's a cemetery right there. Now, how do you get in there? What the hell are these things? Tinfoil hats? Oh, no, they're smiling Sam and Cohort. Uh, rather than take a risk, I'm just going to blast them all. 
Uh, fire maybe? Pretty good damage. Stop moving. Okay. Brain shock. Okay. Well, now I know these these puppets do brain shock. Her out, you know. Wait, how am I doing for health? Yep, good, I could do better. Alright, oh, I guess I'm gonna stay here and grind a little. There's the pumpkin kid. I don't know what this is about, but okay. Confronted the trick or trick kid. I like that. that. That's a pretty good way of describing him. Trick or trick. He looks like he's weak to fire. Let's try fire. He's made a pumpkin. Yeah, that, that hurt pretty well. He didn't get a chance. Ooh, level up. Ooh, baby! Okay. Don't enter. This must be the hidden path right here, actually. Uh. Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready. Stay fuzzy pickles. I mean, like how Paulus is totally not in the way. Wow, what a great photographer photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. Um Huh. Okay, well I thought Hmm, I well I figured this is the path that goes right through the center of the cemetery. So Maybe there's something in the cemetery I have to examine. Let's fight. I saw you, garbage can monster. Oh my god, it's Gra it's Oscar. Um. He's not weak to that. Okay. Try freeze. He's hella weak to that. Mm, boy, he really hits hard though. Okay. I don't know. Do I just examine these? They said there's a hidden path in the center of the graveyard. A couple of those guys. I only want to fight two, or I only want to fight one. Let's try the other side then. Uh, go up. No. Maybe it's a rock. No. It's weird. I got a photo from examining the grave. Oh, maybe. That's a monster. It isn't. Okay. Teddy bear. Thank you. I, lo I love teddy bears. Hint shop realization. Okay. Well, let's go in here and see what he have to say. You want a hint? He wants money, though. Now, wait a minute, youngster. I could give you a great hint for just $60. You'd like a hint, wouldn't you? So you're telling me you don't want a hint. 
You're either awfully confident or $60 is too much to pay. Ah, anyway, a young man like you is very unusual these days. If you happen to need him, come on back. I'm here all the time. Uh. This is here. I can't examine it. I'm trying to see if I could, like, do something. Okay. Well, I got a teddy bear. That's pretty good. Free teddy bear. Just from going into a garbage can. This bulletin board greets you this evening. All is well. Good night. This doesn't look like I can enter. Nope. I'm a wimpy little guy, so I can't open the door. You know, it's scary. Oh, there's a girl with a pet mouse. Let's see what they have to say about this. Hey, you don't look so happy. You better cheer up or you'll become a zombie. Some people have already become tools of the zombies. You're awfully kind talking, taking time to talk to a mouse. This mouse loves you. Ah, a zombie! I'm watching a zombie movie. Can you come by later? I'm sorry, but I think you ought to leave now. I have no guarantee that you're not a zombie out looking for lunch. I was here already. Desert that way. Hint up that way. Tucson to the left. Graveyard. Oh, there was an opening in the fence. Okay. And then there's a bunch of, like, circus stuff to the south of town. Okay, so there's a hospital, shop. I already bought what I could from the shop. And then there's a guy behind a building selling what appears to be dangerous, dangerous equipment, like bottle rockets. I might buy a bottle rocket, actually. Let me see. I don't know how. I think a bottle rocket costs like 200 something dollars. All right. He's got bombs, and he's got a bottle rocket. And neither of us can use them, though. But we can use bombs. Let me see if there's anything on me that I can sell. $19? Yeah, skip sandwich. Who cares about those? Won't buy a pack stage pass. Good luck, buddy. Mm. Ah, there it is. Bees. Bees are hella weak to fire, I know that much. Garbage man, okay. The fact that this music- I think this music usually denotes you can- you have a chance. Dang. Teddy bear's still good, though. Nest leveled up. Okay. Insect spray, okay. Oh, could this... Uh, vampires. Oh, he stares into your soul. He looks you over. Hmm. Okay, well, I can't go that way. 
Maybe? What happens if I use an item on them? Can I do that? Uh, I got an insect spray. What does that do? Besides, eat off beetle. Oh! Heals 100 points of damage to any bug when used during combat. Gone after one use. Huh. I need to remember those. Um... Hmm. So these guys are vampires, I guess. Okay. Well, I... They're obviously what I need to get past, but I don't know how to get past them. Maybe there's an item. Yeah, I thought garbage men. Whoa. Well, one of them's a garbage man. I don't know what the other... Smelly ghost. Figure melted into thin air. Okay. A lot of experience for killing these types. Okay, it's another one of you. Um, try fire on him. Same as ice. Teddy bear is now a pile of fluff. stop maybe take a look at the chick in the front of the hotel regardless of some people I've seen her hanging out with I think I'd like to spend some time with her chick in front of the hotel oh bus stops um bus has been canceled okay health do you have normally? Like, okay. That's alright. Uh. <laughs> Do not like this. This is totally a trap. This has to be a trap. God, this is creepy. I knew it. Totally a trap. Losing consciousness. What could be the fate of Ness and his friend? Thrown into dungeon? Can I get up? Oh, there we go. Door is locked. I'm calling out to you who I've never met. I'm calling our friend who we've never met. Jeff! Jeff! We need your help! 
I'm Paul, and I'm another with another friend, Ness. We are trying to contact you. Winters, a small country to the north. No wood boarding house. I am Paula and I am with another friend, Ness. We are trying to contact you. If you hear me, please wake up and head south. Only you, though far away, can save us, Jeff. Please hear my call and begin heading south. Jeff, you are a friend who we've never met, but you are our one and only hope. Okay. Now, Jeff, I just dreamed that you and I were taking a walk. Wrong. Jeff, where are you going in the middle of the night? You know the dorm rules, right? If you get caught, you're going to get punished big time. What's wrong, Jeff? All right. There must be some reason that I don't understand. I won't stop you. But it's dangerous to leave without taking anything along. Hey. I think there's some stuff in the locker room that you should get. I'll help you get out of here. Nice. I don't know who you are. Tony. Okay. Jeff and Tony. I hear a creature called Tessie lives in the southern lake. I don't believe it. I think someone made a model and placed it in the lake. I hear a more interesting story than the rumor about Tessie. It's about the cave boys at Stonehenge. Many claim to have actually seen them. I wonder if the rumors is true that the center of Stonehenge is an entrance leading some place. Someday we should check it out. I'm sleepy. I'll wash my face, brush my teeth, do my business, and go to bed. Oh, Jeff and Tony, you startled me. Are you looking for a late night snack? I'm having some trouble with my project. If only Jeff's father, Dr. An and Donuts, were here. He'd be able to provide a great deal of help. I hear I heard he's an astounding person. He's the first leader of our Ultra Science Club. I hear it he's greater than even I Einstein or Heisenberg. Rumor has it he's also very strange. If you're heading to the locker room, take this key along. It's a little bent, though. Thanks. Got the key to the locker. If you leave, call me and I'll record your adventure. It's like saving the game. <laughs> Are you my dad? No. Ah, uh, this must be it then. Doesn't fit. Okay. Oh wait, um... So that means I need a machine or something to fix the key? Because it just keeps saying bent. <laughs> hey, monkey. Um, do I just try all of them? I honestly don't know what to do. Big bottle rocket, though. I think you can get out by going over the gate. We need to get some stuff to take with you. There's a shop. He has two whole dollars. Oh, hey. 
Cookie. Thanks. Cookie. Thanks. Empty. Oh. I can't believe you do something so nasty. Took all these kids cookies. Whatever, Jeff is a badass. something no all right <laughs> just gave me a machine that for fixing the bad key machine Gee, thanks. Nice of him to give me that. Okay, got everything. After robbing everybody blind. Oh. Hey, now use me as a step and climb over the gate. Uh, I'll say goodbye for now. I don't know where you're going or why, but remember, we're best friends forever. Later, dude. Bubble gum here is incredible. You should see the size of the bubbles they can blow. There's a monkey at the entrance. Take the monkey, it's really nosy. You buy a pack of bubble gum, you can have the monkey for free. Otherwise, he will cost you a buck. Do I need this monkey? You absolutely positively should buy him, if you know what I mean. Hello there, how can I help you? D Rex shirt, non stick frying pan, coin of silence. I don't have an ATM card. Let me see how much a pack of gum costs. I can't buy a pack of gum. Oh wait, 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 I need to call a guy. I got a monkey. I got a pet monkey. Jeff got the pack of bubblegum. Give me 
poison gum. <laughs> the monkey joined the party. Bubble monkey. Okay. I guess that's his name. I should have just saved after that point, shouldn't I? South. All right, let's pick a fight with this mound goat. Face, yeah. My God. Opportune attack, and then I auto killed it. Cool. Free cookie. Hint. Right, I have no use for the butterfly, I forgot. Oh, kids. Tame animals have become wild. Something evil is going on. So why don't you rest here for a short while? Have something to drink. Grab some tea. Feeling much better? Good luck. If I knew he, this tent was here, I would have probably stayed. Or I probably wouldn't have used all my healing items. No, no, more, no matter though, I'm getting all my healing items back. I was hoping to get a preempt. Good God, that goat. Two O freaking P.
Wonder what happens if he collects one of these. Nothing, probably. Okay, well, I'm not getting anything from the killing these guys now. Alright, that's not the right way. I can maybe back this way? Nope. Oh, a dog. Time to beat a dog up with a gun. <laughs> Time to shoot dog. Another tent? Just a random tent. Hmm. Oh! I heard that the wind is always blowing when Tessie appears. I do! I feel like I'm catching a cold. Tessie may unexpectedly be living in the woods. I personally think so. If I find Fiat Tessie, do you think I'll get in the newspaper? I'm looking for my 15 minutes of fame. Go for it, bad boy! Alright, I'll be right back. I gotta use the bathroom real quick. Okay. Ugh. What a cute little monkey. Would you like a piece of gum? Maybe monkeys don't like gum. You're right. We're here at Lake Tess, waiting to see Tessie. We're known as the Tessie Watching Club. Another empty tent. cook for the Tessie Watching Club. How about some stew? No, no. There's no need to pay me. You and your friend who I've never met before. Jeff, head south. I'm Paula. If you hear this message, go to the south. Working through the night, Jeff fixed the broken spray can. After being fixed, the broken spray can became the defense spray. Wait, this is a, this is a heal spot? Yeah. And I repaired something overnight, so let me see if maybe that'll... No? Well, I got a defense spray now, so... But I still got a broken air gun. Let me see if I can do that again. See if I can get that air gun to be repaired. I think I mean need more intelligence for it. Okay. Or IQ. 
He has to have like a certain level IQ to be able to do things. Daytime, huh? So Okay. Shot a dog with a pop gun. Wind is appearing. Huh? He just showed up out of nowhere? Right. Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready? Say, fuzzy pickle. And yeah, Jeff doesn't care. What a great photograph. It'll always bring back the fondest of memories. I don't, he can't, he doesn't have any PP points. Or PowerPoint. I'm just mostly level grinding. <laughs> hey Q-Tip. Let's go rest and then 
maybe we'll get wind. So, Tessie is supposed to appear uh, when the wind is blowing. Oh wait, this is the wrong tent, I think. Yeah. Or wait, let me just save here, and then... Alright, and then sleep. Or eat stew. Apparently eating stew counts as sleep. I'm gonna assume Tessie is like a boss. Okay, it's Wendy. There she is. Yeah, yeah, give me some gum. Alright, here's some gum. And. That's Tessie. Uh, okay. <laughs> Loch Ness Monster. God dang it, Loch Ness Monster! You get out of here! Alright. No control over it, it's just Tessie's going by herself. Good going, Bubble Monkey. I like the idea. I think this is like a, a play on Michael Jackson's monkey, Bubbles. Here? Okay. Monkey? Alright. Bye bye, Tessie. Bye bye now. Am I gonna be able to get back? Probably not. Oh, another goat. Let's fight. Head bash that headbutt this goat. Damn, dude, he still attacks faster than Jeff. Alright, one more. Nice. He missed. This dungeon has no entrance fee. Come on in! Now we can use the- what? Hold on a second, let me try that again. Jeff used a protractor. Now he can fairly easily figure out the angle of various things. Huh? Welcome to my modest dungeon. Brick Road. Come here, mouse. Let's fight! Six. Red roll, thank you. I got attacked by go. Uh, I'm getting attacked by a mad duck. Okay, Mill is in this game. Got it. Oh, 
I don't have PSI, so it doesn't make any it doesn't make any difference if I can't use Psy attacks. <laughs> Insecticide. Do I have anything else? How's the boil egg help? Eaten. Oh, that's the best recovery item I have on me. This is like 20? 30, okay. Can use it during battle. Let's take this. It's insecticide, might as well. So there should be another mob down here now. No? Oh, you, you're you a mimic. I'm getting attacked by a mimic. Worthless protoplasm. There's a mad duck right there. Let's fight him. Round two. Figured I'd level up by now. I should probably read that sign. Croissant! That's the best healing item I've come across so far. 60 HP for heal. Watch for falling materials. Brick Road. Oh! <laughs> Great. Yep. Patches taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready, say, fuzzy pickles. Wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. All right, let's see if I can continue getting out of here. Oh, just another I think it's probably worthless. Yeah, worthless. Dang! He actually hit me for once. Wow, the monkey actually got a smash. Level up. Okay. I want that item, whatever it is. Come here, rat, let's fight. Weapon? It is. Much better than my weapon. Way to go! Please come back again. 
Maybe it was too easy. My name's Rick Rose, the dungeon developer. I've devoted my life to making dungeons. Well, by combining my skills and Dr. Andonut's intelligence, I can become Dungeon Man. The first combination of human and dungeon in history. Let's meet again once I've become Dungeon Man. Would you like to get a good night's rest? Thanks. I, I would dare definitely enjoy that. Did I get a, um... I'm gonna rest again to see maybe if given another chance, because whenever you sleep as uh, Jeff, he has a chance of repairing something in his inventory, providing he has enough IQ points. I honestly don't know what the limits are for it, though. But it works. Mouse? Mouse. Let's fight, kid! Dang, man. Well, I killed him, though. So it's fine. <laughs> Good god. That's, like, double damage. Oh, there's a... is that a bug or a slug? It's a slug. Random mushroom right there. Oh, slugs. How is that? What? Come on! That's bullshit. Whatever. More HP, though. What is that? Bottle rocket. Oh my god. What to do when nothing looks good? Didn't realize mushrooms were a thing in this dungeon? Almost like they did it on purpose. They're just not gonna let me go past, are they? Mushrooms. Heck, I'm gonna go back.
Hmm. Insta kill rats now. Get a butterfly even though I can't use it. High IQ. Not high enough, apparently. Um. Hmm. Try again. I got 9 IQ now. See if I can do anything with that. Sheesh. <laughs> Wish the monkey would get stronger. But the monkey seems to only get stronger in parallel to him. You know what? I think I can probably... Okay. Let's do it. Let's fight him. Should auto kill it. Almost. Okay, never mind.
Protractor. Let me see here. I want to look that up. I, I'm not sure if that's actually worth keeping. Okay, that's what I figured. Interesting. Uh, that's the way, but the rope is cut. Not sure how to deal with that. The attack slug is attacking. I think this is the right way. Yeah. Maybe one day the monkey will be strong enough to kill it. Under 18. Okay, I'm almost leveled up again. fight. Hmm. No IQ though, but we'll do. See if I can go through. The issue is, throat is cut. Rope is cut. How do you, how do you deal with this? Good. That's what I figured. <laughs> Thanks. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna go out, heal, for free, and then save. I think guarding the door looks like it could be, like, a uh, final... Something like a My Sanctuary equivalent. Thank <laughs> you. 
Which is weird, because Jeff isn't Ness, so he shouldn't be fighting bosses that are Ness's bosses. Also, I don't want to use any of my rockets. Those are very powerful. for a bit, so I should be fine. At least I think I'm gonna be fine. Could instant kill it. Yeah. I can probably level up one more time before I get to the boss. One more fight. Or two. There we go. That's pretty good. Holy crap, that was a big jump. Alright, let's see. He got three boost. He got a boost of three. Excuse me. He got a boost of three in his Intel or his IQ, so I think that should be pretty good. Let's see if that'll actually work. The idea is that when, yeah, whenever he sleeps, he has a chance to repair something, providing he has enough IQ to do it. I 
guess he doesn't have enough IQ now. I'll try it again. I'm gonna try again, because I honestly don't know what the IQ levels are. Imagine it should, it would, it, it physically, or it prompts you, if you do it right, or if you know. Um. Weird how sometimes I get stuck. Kill things that are easy to kill to get free points. Dang, I was hoping you'd kill it. There you go. Bubble Monkey actually got some a win. You know what, I think I can take him. Yeah. Yeah, I'm having fun. I'm definitely liking this. What's in here? Oh, that was an enemy. Cave boy, here's your chance for a surprise attack. Boss? I want to know if that was a boss. I don't know. Uh. Hold on, I'm getting out of here. Oh my... No, 
Okay, I'm getting away. Check the surroundings here before I... Oh. You kids don't look very bright. Let me explain. These stones are making a pattern. It's called stoneant. We UFOs often visit here. You must have seen it on TV or read about it in the tabloids. Yes, that stonehenge. Ooh, a lab. Mr. Brickboard, the dungeon master, referred to you, right? And not only that, but what? Who? My son? Oh, I can't, I can't believe it. Yo, Jeff, my son. It's been ten years since I last saw you. I'm so glad you're a healthy boy. Oh, those glasses look good on you. How about a donut? Well, I was only offering. I also like a donut right now. Have you already checked the Stonehenge? Well, at least I asked. Hmm, hmm, okay. By the way, why are you here? Oh, I see. That girl named Paula has sensed I was here. Okay, I'll try to help you out. I'm trying to make a phase disorder that can connect two points in space and time. It's still incomplete. I'll let you use another invention I call the Skyrunner. It's a little old, but it will certainly help. When you board, always listen for the message that comes from your destination. You'll get there for sure if you listen to the message. The round machine over there is the Skyrunner. What do you think? Isn't it neat? Get in. Let's go together in ten years or so. Wait, that was the machine? I didn't even see what was up there! God damn it! What happened? It's not moving. Hey, why don't you try pressing a button on the controller? I didn't even see what was upstairs. I hope there was nothing important up there. That's so fucking annoying. It's like, great. There was probably something good in that machine, or upstairs, and I just didn't even think. Where am I now? I'm in... Foreside? Foreside. And off I go. Desert? Ah, okay. Now I'm here. That noise. Oh, it's this thing. in my knuckles cuz Oh my god. Well, I certainly can't get back there now. Oh man, oh man, did you ever scare me? Skyrunner. I guess it took a little damage while landing. Oh well. You don't have to explain a thing. I'm Jeff. I came here because you called me. I'm not very strong. Really nearsighted, kind of shy, and I tend to be a little reckless. This is just the way I am. I hope you want me as your friend. Alright, let's get back in the journey then. Nice. Just like that, Jeff joined the party.
urban zombie in his cohort. I think freeze probably works pretty well. And then I'll spy on the zombie process processor. No fire, okay. Offense, 28. Defense, vulnerable to Psy, vulnerable to Flash. Paul level up, Jeff level up. I don't think healing works. No. So he got possessed by a ghost. the hotel let me try the hotel no not the hotel the hospital see if I can talk to the guy at the hospital to get rid of his possession down one more street no, actually was making sure that he doesn't get damaged by that either. Though you may not believe it, I'm a healer. If you have some illness, I can have it be treated at the hospital. It's my job to cure you. Purify, maybe? Really? I have to pay money? Wait, I should have checked to see if they had an ATM. Let's see, do they have one? Man, the, the slowdown in this area is just crazy.
god, there's so much menuing in this game. Ugh. God, this is so annoying. Alright, I gotta take a bathroom break again. Be right back. Okay. He would have turned. Alright, I got enough money to do things, so let's get out of here. Alright, I gotta go to the hospital. Talk to the purple man to... Went the wrong way, I think. There it is. Hotel up a uh, street.
180 dollars cripes he fixed the air gun got a magnum air gun nice yes Sir, oh, you got up early today. The guests' new papers were delivered to the hotel today are different than normal. The paper's called the Zombie Herald. I'm scared, but let me tell you what's in it. Two human kids escaped by somehow opening their cage. A few days ago, the zombies got some kids at the hotel. The boy had a red cap. Hey, it was you! Huh. <laughs> I wonder if that kid, that air cap gun that that guy was carry, this guy sells, is more powerful than the weapon that he currently has equipped. It is not. I don't know what a rust promoter is. Bomb. A bomb! I should have saved, because now I have that gun. Let's do that real quick. I gotta go north. Right, uh, the vampires were in the way of the place that I needed to go. One trash monster. Yeah, it's, I can deal with that. Ash. Freeze. Spot. I think it nearly kills him. He should be dead. Okay. Jeff is about to level up again. Okay, still can't do anything with that. Hmm. I can't think of anything that's locked. How did the ghost catch me? Come on! Okay, Jeff's up. Fire, okay. And flash. And paralysis. Yes. 
69 damage. Okay, so those guys are almost never worth fighting. Oh god. Great. Yeah, pretty weak to it. Figure the snowy ghost melted into ah, melted into thin air. It's just so laggy. It's like Blight Town lag. People used to call me evil, but those zombies are so much more evil. I left my wife and kids at home to escape to this tent. That's how scary the zombies are. Frankly, I'm running scared. I didn't mean that I actually run around. I just mean I'm frightened. Conditions in town are getting worse. So those people are now added to the tent? I guess so. Ah, doggo. Hey, doggo. <laughs> And that's a boss. Is this a boss? Thank <laughs> you. 
It used flash. Okay. Good. Level 18. Jeff 16. Huh. Jar of fly honey. Bees make bee honey and flies make fly honey. Zombie leader is strong because he eats peanut butter and fly honey sandwiches. Peanut butter and fly honey sandwiches. Never heard of that one. Wait, how much money do I have again? 180. I think that's enough to buy a bottle rocket. <laughs> Plenty of, actually. I don't know what a rust promoter is. I want to look that up. I'm going to look that up because I honestly don't know what it is and the game doesn't want to tell me. Hmm. Let's see. Deals damage to mechanical monsters. I guess I'll buy one. No, there's not really any ghosts. There's not really any robots around here, are there? Alright. Dad's calling. <laughs> Zombie paper. Thanks. Thanks, Apple Kid. Pretty nice. Good guy, Apple Kid. He gave me zombie pa- he's gonna send me some zombie paper. Ooh, Ness and Zeph are about to level up. Jeff fixed the iron, it is now a slime generator. Slime generator, 
spray is a sticky substance that stops the enemy from moving. Can be used multiple times. Hmm. Ah, there he is. While delivering pizza, this weird guy asked me to help you out. He wanted me to deliver this to someone named Ness, who's wandering around three. No one knows about this, right? Let's just pretend that you're Ness, and I'll give this to you. Oh, hello, Ness! Just go along with this one, okay? I made this decision that you're Ness, no matter what. That's right, Ness. Wink, wink. I've done my duty in giving you Apple Kids the thing of a jig. Oh, goodbye! Well, now I got the zombie paper and I've got the honey, the, the fly honey. So I think I can probably use this. Well, I was gonna pick a fight. There we go. Oh. You didn't. Okay. Six. The freeze and open the hypnosis. Okay. There we go. Nestled it up. You got PSI Rock and Beta. Can't be used here, can't be used here. Okay. Okay, so how do I use this? Oh, I, I know. I know. They were making jokes about using this tent. The 
Let's see if maybe I can talk to them about giving them... Maybe I can give them the items. Zombie paper is a stupid product name. Not sure where to use this. I just gotta... Really? Hmm. Well, let me read it and see what it says. Major stinkage here. Hey, Mixie, how you doing? I got attacked by a ghost and a garbage man. Oh, I got attacked by two ghosts. Um... Okay, Flash. Freeze. Shh, I don't know what to do when he can't do much of anything to either of these. She should kill him in one hit, I think. Yep, he's dead. Okay, Flash. Can't stop crying. Ash. Fire. Shoot. What's, what's drawing hentai? What? Who's drawing hentai? Who gave him a good bash? Somebody's calling me. Hello, it's your dad. You've been out there for a long time now. It may be none of my business, but don't you think you it would be a good idea to take a break? Oh, yeah. Somebody's asked me about drawing hentai before, and I said no. It's like, I don't draw hentai. Now you're banned. <laughs> but yeah, that was my chat rules. He's like, no, I don't draw for free. You're banned, too. But yeah, that, that's, uh... I should probably change those, huh? Trying to be trolly? I, I, I won't ban you. I know you. I can't ban all the, all the people, can I? 
Yeah, yeah, it was like a rando dude who just sort of came in one day and just said, Hey, you draw, how much does it cost to get somebody to draw some hentai? It's like, I can't, uh, not only do I not draw hentai, you're not allowed to draw hentai on Twitch. You gotta go to Picardo if you want to watch those kinds of people. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. I got a jar of honey and I'm supposed to use it to, uh, give it to a guy? I'm supposed to give it to a guy named Belch. I have no idea who Belch is. So how you doing, Mixie? Are you a rando, dude? No. Also, thanks for the host, Mixie. You've never asked me to draw hentai before, Q-Tip. Fudge. The bee got me. You burnt you burnt a finger? Dang. What'd you do? Put your hand on a stove or something? 69 damage. Oh wait, I don't know what just a oh, zombie dog. Get back here, you stupid dog. I'm gonna kill you. This is a Dark Souls dog. Before Dark Souls was a thing. Oh wait, um, I remember what it was. She used ice. Ice is ridiculously good against dog. And then I'll use Jeff just to be sure. Yeah, totally like a Dark Souls dog. And yeah, I killed it. Would it be arcade? It would be awkward if you did. Yeah, it'd be pretty awkward. Maybe I should just start a twi uh, a Picardo stream so people can ask me to draw porn for them. It's like, I don't draw porn, though. But I guess if people pay me, I could. You ask me to draw a duck sometime? I was drawing a duck. And Milt said he wanted me to draw emotes. Or he was going to get to me about emotes, but he never did. He's like, hmm. Well, yeah, I was, like, in the middle of drawing, like, a, a duck that was laughing. Let me try this again. So what I'm supposed to do is I'm supposed to catch zombies. I'm in a zombie vill I'm a village that's been overrun by zombies. People don't know what to do. They're freaking out. Just imagine, when we wake up tomorrow? <sighs> oh, I know. I'll sleep at the end. Maybe that'll change it. Maybe if just sleeping at an end will change. Oh, there's a guy with a pumpkin on his head trying to attack me. All right, let's try that again. Sleep at the end. Do I have enough? Yeah. It's like $180 to stay at this end. It must be the greatest inn in the world. Paula, Paula is next, okay. It's too colorful for zombies. It's really... It makes me think of, like, Lavender Town from, like, Pokemon. But yeah, it's like $180 for a sleep. Oh my, is this really what's happening? It really did happen! Nice, I knew... I knew thinking about something hard enough will make it happen. Look at them all go. They're just going into the circus tent for some reason. Alright. <laughs> that works. Boogie Tent Falls. Young people to blame. <laughs> oh wait, I'm gonna save again. Yeah, I know, right? I thought they were- I didn't even think they were zombies. I thought they were, like, ghost, uh, vampires or something. Yuck, we caught a lot of zombies. It's really gross. You might not understand saying this, but poor zombies. I may- I was able to arrest many zombies because of your help. Arrest zombies sounds strange, doesn't it? We did it! Did you look in the tent? 
We caught stupid caught those stupid zombies a lesson. Those zombies stuck to the floor? I wonder if they could still get me. I don't care what happened to anyone else. I just want to save my own skin. This man has a wife and a child, and he just sort of ran off. What? I draw Yaoi hentai, but under a pseudonym? I don't draw Yaoi. Why would I do that? Zombie paper really works. So I hope someone comes up with pretty girl paper. <laughs> that wasn't a nice thing to say. I'll blame you for the rest of my life. There's no response. I'll blame you after my death. If I try to get away, my body will fall apart. It's because I'm a zombie. There's no response. Could you help me? Maybe not. You humans are such cowards. I don't care if I pass away. <laughs> I'm dead already. <laughs> Alright. 